Who is the fairest in the land? Not you, buggy nose. <laughs> Liar! Come in! Oh, hello, headmistress. I've just had such a lovely lunchtime stroll in the park. The little puppies were singing in the trees, and the little birds were chasing sticks on the lawn. And I just thought, oh, aren't I lucky to be alive? Come on! Yes, headmistress. Put a sock in it. Oh, but I was only trying to tell well, you... Well, don't! That... Uh, oh. I see you've got my lunchtime mail. Yes, there's one from the electricity yes, board. I know how to deal with my own mail. Thank you very much. Uh, oh. Right, 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 right. You. Tristy. Yes. Telephone. Bodger. Bodger. Really? Is there one for Simon? Who on earth would be wanting to write to him? I don't know. He doesn't normally get any mail. I wonder who it could be from. So do I, Moon. So do I. Isn't it class time yet? No, not till the bell goes off. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> oh! Here he goes. Oh, oh I was going to make you a cup of tea. Then what? Oh. Oh, well, I'll just switch the kettle off then. No need, I'll oh, do it. Right. I'll just take that letter down to Mr. Bond. No Bobby. need, oh, I'll do it. Right. Uh, oh, thank you very much, Head Mistress. Don't mention it. Uh, and uh, have a pleasant afternoon, Moon. Oh, thank you again, Head Mistress. Now, let's just take a little peek inside. Have a pleasant afternoon yourself, Head Mistress. I'll try. Bye! Interfering nosebag. Just sticking her trunk in where it's up. Oh. Careful now. Really? Oh, is it, does it? Now, we shall see. We shall see. Dear Mr. Borgia, congratulations. You have just won first prize in the Wonder Mash competition. First prize? And one of our Wonder Mash team will be calling at Letsby Avenue Junior School this afternoon to present you with a thousand pounds. Thousand pounds? Strange. But suddenly I feel quite fond of Mr. Bodger. Well, it's a very smart rocket station badge. I oh, know. And it's a very neat rocket. Yeah. But what exactly is it for? I'll show you. Hey. But Badger, what's the point of filling up the rocket with mashed potato? Rocket fuel. Oh, rocket. What? Fuel. Stupid. Cool. Badger, mashed potato is not rocket fuel. Is. Isn't. Is. Badger. Sorry. But what are you doing now? Gonna launch it. Hey, Stoke. So this cardboard rocket's gonna take off into space, is it? Yeah. Fueled by mashed potato. Affirmative. Affirmative. I'd like to see it. You will, ten. Hey. So nine. Oh. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Blast off. Hey. What are you doing? Mr. Budger. Oh, uh. This is Bogart. I'm so sorry. Ah, uh, uh, thanks, sir. Um, what can I say? Never mind, Mr. Bodger. I'm so terribly, terribly... Did you say never mind? Yes, well, after all, it's only mashed potato, isn't it? As <laughs> usual. <laughs> yes, and if it's all dribbling down my face, well, I can always wipe it off, can't I, Mr. Bodger? <laughs> I suppose so, Mrs. Bogart. <laughs> Please, call me Prunella. Oh, OK, Prunella. That's better. Have a chocolate. What's wrong with them? Nothing's wrong with them. Nothing's wrong with them, Simon. Oh, you see, I can't enjoy chocolates anymore. Not after what happened to my sister. Oh, sister? Yes, my identical twin sister. I never knew you had an identical twin sister. I don't. Uh, I mean, I don't suppose you did know. Oh. I've never mentioned her before today. <laughs> hey, mistress, you're, you're crying. Yes. Oh, here. Here. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, my poor, poor sister. Oh, what's happened to her? I'd say to all of them. Oh. It's too upsetting. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, OK. All right, I will then. This morning, my poor sister had a slight disagreement with a steamroller. And now, her leg's all wrapped up in bandages and sticking out here. Sticking out of her ear? No, not sticking out of her ear. Sticking out like this. Oh. And there's only one doctor in the whole world who can fix it. But he charges money. Well, if I had any money, I... Oh, I haven't got any money. <sighs> Nor me. Terrible, isn't it? Being flat broke with no chance of being rich ever. Yeah. Not ever. Yeah. Mind you, there's always the competition. Competition? Ooh, entered a competition, have you? Yeah. The first prize is a... Ah, oh, what chance have I got of winning? <sighs> What chance indeed? Hmm. No, I think it's best you forget I ever mentioned my poor you-know-who. 
Unless, of course, by some incredible fluke, you just happen to win the mashed potato competition. Oh, some hope. Yeah, how do you know it was a mashed potato competition? Lucky guess. Oh. oh. By the way, Simon, this letter arrived for you this lunchtime. A letter? I wonder who from. Search me. Bye. Oh, bye. Bye. Oh, very good. Well done. Well, I wonder what... Let's see. Oh, be careful, Badger. Steady on, steady on, steady on. You're going to tear it, Badger. Let's see what it is, eh? Let's see. Done your writing. It's upside down. Oh, cool. Right. What? I don't believe it. What? What? It's true. What? Badger? Yeah? We won! <laughs> <laughs> I've got to rub your lippy. OK, Badge, I've got to get cleaned up and go and tell Bogey. <laughs> he's thinking about it. He's deciding. Now he's climbing up the stairs. Now he's coming along the corridor. And here he is, bang on cue. Come in! Hello, Prunella. Prunella. <laughs> Guess what was in the letter? Letter? It was a letter, no idea. The competition results. I won first prize. A thousand pounds! No! Really? Yes, really. So, if you like, I can help out your um, twin sister. You mean, pay for the whole operation? Well, I don't know. Marvellous. When's the money arriving? Oh, they said sometime this afternoon. Oh, well, that'll be fine. Oh. I'll phone my sister and tell her to get her wheelchair over here pronto. Oh, OK, and... Uh... And that's all there is to it. Oh. Except, Simon. Yes? Goodbye! <laughs> oh, hello, Joe's Junk Shop? Hello, Joe, yes. Brunella speaking. Yeah, blooming. Absolutely blooming. Now, you know that wheelchair you had in the window? Have you still got it? Have you? Aha. Uh -huh. Excellent. I'll be over straight away. Goodbye! Who wants to be a mirror? Hello, headmistress. I never knew you had an identical twin sister. Oh, hey, not now, Moon. Not now. You both get headaches at the same time. Fine. Flippity gibbets to you. Well, there's Spain. Yeah. Oh, and there's Greece. Yeah. Oh, there's always Hungary. I'm always hungry. I know, Badge. Once this money arrives, you'll never be hungry ever. Uh... I think it is. Must be. Coming. A thousand pounds. A thousand pounds. A thousand. <laughs> huh? Oh, I know who you are. Your Mrs. Bogart's identical twin sister. Come in, come in. That's right. I've just had a terrible accident with a lawnmower. It was a steamroller. A lawnmower, a steamroller. What's your problem? <laughs> I wonder if you could help me. I'm looking for, um, Simon Bodger. Oh, that's me. Oh, so you're the one. Oh, my identical twin sister told me about your marvellous offer and I wheeled myself over here straight away. Oh. How can I ever thank you oh. enough? Has the money arrived yet? No, not yet. So tell us it's to your ear. No. I'd rather you didn't. Oh, really? Why is that? Because, because it might upset her too much seeing me like this. You know how delicate and sensitive she is, so... If you don't mind, I think I'll just sit here and wait for the cash. Oh, OK, fine. Um, just out of interest, how much is this operation going to um, cost? Oh, not much. Oh, that's good. About a thousand pounds. Oh, with that... a thousand pounds? That's right. Well, it's not too much, is it? Oh, of course not. That'll be fine. Fine. Good. Mm. A cup of coffee would be nice. Mm. Oh, sure, yeah. yeah. So, um, what's the weather like out? Dreadful. Oh, that's nice. Oi. Oi. Get away. If she sees you, she'll Nothing. tell Bogey. Yes, yes. yes. That is Bogey. Yes, yes. yes. No, it just looks like her. It's her. No, it's an identical twin sister. What? Oh, oh yes, definitely. Uh, get away, she'll see you. Isn't my coffee ready yet? Yes, right here. Here. Oh, bum bags. Oh. <laughs> Chesty cough. No, it's her. She's got mashed potato in her ear holes. From my rocket. That's right, Spider. I better tell Rocky and Vicky. There they are. Oh, Oi, Rocky, Vicky. What's he back? Look, you've got to come and stop Simon giving all our money to old Bogey Nose. What are you doing? I can't explain now. I've got to get a cushion and some drawing pins. But can you meet me on the stairs quick as you can, OK? OK, thank you. Try. OK. Now, 